Before we get into today's video, I wanted to quickly thank AOA.com for sponsoring this channel. AOA is a great place to get all of your Rocket League items including wheels, crates, keys, and much more. Use coupon code JSPADE to save 3% at checkout. And welcome back guys, it is Jack Volspade. I am back in with some more Rocket League, and tonight we are going to be taking a look at our bonus gifts, um, the items that our decryptors were transferred into on the update. Um, I know that it pulls from the Vindicator series and the Revival series. I'm not sure exactly what's in the Revival series, I just know that there's some special edition versions of old wheels like FSLs and Spiralis, stuff like that. That. So, um, I know that we've got eight on our main account, and we'll probably have a couple on our alt accounts as well. I'll just go ahead and cut it all together into one video. But, um, just, you know, to put it out there, obviously everybody's already seen what's going on with the ridiculous pricing um, after the update and uh, the item shop and how, you know, the first day they were asking $14 for unpainted Infiniums, which are probably worth around 10, 15, maybe 20 cents. Um, so, you know, it's it's pretty rough. Um, it's a pretty well-known strategy to come out with ridiculously high prices and have the player base rage and then eventually lower them a little bit to try and convince people that they're better than the original prices. Um, it's still going to be ridiculous after they change them, but I just want to let you guys know if any of you are thinking for a second that you would spend any of your hard-earned money on a regular exotic from the item shop um, go ahead and hit me up I am totally fine at giving away my regular exotics I've got way too many of them and it just absolutely hurts me that they are willing uh, to disrespect the player base that much so if you guys you know want any regular exotics just go ahead and hit me up um, and yeah I'm just going to put that offer out there. I know there were a couple other people who put that offer out on the first day, but I just want to make sure that you guys know that you don't need to get ripped off like that. So it's going to be a Victor Dominus Rare decal for that first one. Nothing too interesting. I know that everything that comes from these bonus gifts is going to be untradeable anyways. Um, Sky Blue Ouchie there. I think that... Ouchie wasn't originally able to come painted. Not exactly sure about that though. Octane Kana, kind of kind of cool decal, but obviously we already got a few of them. <clears throat> Very rare. Oh, okay. So I guess we got the uh, the you know FSLs that people have been talking about. I guess they're not labeled as special edition. I guess they're just called FSLBs. I guess they're a different wheel altogether. But that's pretty cool. Um, yeah, I, I definitely like that. I think that's a it's a cool little um, improvement to be made on the original FSLs. Rare here. Octane Abtruce, no paint. Two left after this. Uh, another rare. Fennec Edge Burst, Guardian Cert. <coughs> Truncheon, Victor. And just another rare. Not too great. It's gonna be a lime clod hopper there. So yeah, that really wasn't great. But we got one FSL, so I guess that was good. And we'll go ahead and cut to our first alt now. Okay, so it looks like we've got three on this account. So we'll see what happens. Hopefully we get better luck than our main. <clears throat> Very rare. Uh, Tactician Kana. Not too interesting. Very rare again. Light speed. Not too interesting. 
import. That's good. Uh, pixel fire. All right. Well, at least we got an import. Not that it really matters, because I, I'm imagining you can't trade those up, right? Because they killed all trade ups. Oh my God! Did did they seriously add all of the commons and uncommons to your inventory? That's horrible. Honestly, I can't believe I didn't realize that already, but that's just so unneeded. There's no reason to do that. It just makes everything harder to find. Oh my god. They crazy. Yep, can't be traded in. All right. All right, there's just one on this account, so here we go. Just a rare, yet again. Black Abtruse. All right, next account. All right, so we've got six on this account. That's definitely a bit better of a number. Hopefully there's something interesting somewhere in here. Um, I'm not even sure if you can get black markets from these uh, new ones, but... Oh, I guess light speed comes painted now. That's interesting. It's black, um, kind of invisible. You can't even really see it too much. Very rare. Uh, Octane Kana yet again. Good lord. Import, that's good. Alright, so we got a purple sentinel there. Um, I mean, I'm glad that we got another import. That's great. Um, yeah, that's cool. I, I don't have um, a purple sentinel yet. But of course, you can't trade the stuff, so I can't even transfer it onto my main account. So it's kind of worthless. <laughs> oh lord. Epic, epic, epic. Epic games. Crimson Truncheon there. Okay, I guess that's the unpainted version of the FSLB. So, I guess we'll move on to our next account. Alright, so I guess there's four on this account. Um, I'm not sure how many we've done total so far, but uh, I think it's probably going to end up being a little over 20 altogether. So that's a solid number. Hopefully it's entertaining but we're not really getting too much so far. It's, uh, it's not, not, not too interesting. <sighs> Just another rare. Clod Hoppers. All right, and it looks like we got three on this account. So this is gonna be our last account. Um, hopefully we get something cool. Another import, that's great. Oh, okay, so I guess Pixel Fire is one of those things that can come painted now. So we got a sky blue Pixel Fire, I'd say that's pretty cool. And we'll see what's in these last two here. Another import, that's good. Um, Force Green Ninja Star, alright. 